Welcome back little monkey fans. It's Carrie here and today we're going way up to the treetop toy box for our Playmobil blind bag palooza. We have four from series nine and 24 from series 10. I sure hope we don't get any duplicates today. Well, let's get opening. We only have one blue package from series nine. So let's start with that. Oh cool, I think we got one of the warriors. And so here are all of our characters that you can get for our series nine blue bags. And we've gotten a few of these ones already. We have the ranger, we had this caveman warrior, we've had the dwarf king, and then today we got our ninja warrior. And here he is, it's our ninja warrior and he's got these wings around back. They almost look like bat wings and they can rotate around and you can pop those off as well if you'd like. He has some serious weapons here. He has a spectacular double-ended sword along with a sword in his belt and then he has this fantastic armor around up top. It's kind of hard to see with his wings but it comes out in a peak on each side. I wouldn't want to come up against this guy. He looks like a pretty fierce warrior. Let's see what we have in our first Series 9 pink bag. Well, it looks like maybe we got the fairy. Well, let's put her together. And here's our pamphlet for our Series 9 pink bags. And we have gotten a few of these ones as well. We got the awesome cat woman down here. We got this festival girl. And then today we got our fairy. I wonder what we'll get in our other two Series 9 pink bags. And here's our fairy. She has on a wonderful outfit. I love the different colors on there. And she has this magnificent scepter. I love the pearl on the top. And her wings are interesting because they're somewhat folded together. So you can't actually open them up. So they don't snap on individually. They snap in together. And so they are always closed. And then she also has a butterfly tattoo on that arm and then some swirl patterns on her other arm. She's very beautiful. See what we get in this one. Oh, I think we got the flight attendant. And here she is. She's carrying along her suitcase accessory. We can pop that open. She has a great uniform on. I love the scarf she has around the top here. And she even has a bow accessory in her hair around back. And she has a cool hat on top. Very pretty. Looks like she's ready to board her plane. Let's finish off our last series nine. Oh, it looks like maybe the skateboarder. Well, let's get her put together. She is super cool. I just love her skateboard. So she can pop right off of that. There's all these different great patterns and colors on it. And she has some green wheels on the bottom. And I love the size of her skateboard. It's super sturdy. And look at her outfit. She has all these cool silver bits on it. And she has on some great skater pants. She even has some beautiful blue makeup on her eyes. I love her. Now we get to move on to our series 10. I'm so excited. We have 12 of our black and 12 of our purple packages. And I'm hoping that we are gonna get two entire collections. So let's get going. Let's start with our black package first. Look at all of the cool characters you can get in this series. Oh, I can't wait to see if we get that guy. He looks super awesome. Oh, I think maybe we got an Egyptian type one. Let's get him built. And here are all of the different characters that we can get in our Black Series 10 Playmobil bags. There are some cool characters, that's for sure. Look at this. I like the soccer fan, even this cool robot guy. I think this is the one we got here, some type of Egyptian warrior maybe. Well, let's check him out. And here he is. Look at that wonderful headdress he has on. It has the different black striping on it. And of course that can come off. And he has a bunch of gold accessories. So he's got a necklace up around here and then he has his cuffs on each hand. And then he's holding this superb golden spear. On the bottom, he has this white loincloth type outfit on and it actually can pop off just like our women's snappable clothing. So you could pop that off if you wanted to and then he'd be running around in his white undergarments. Ah, put my clothes on. And there's our Egyptian warrior. Let's open up our series 10 purple bag. Oh, I think we got the Inuit. Well, let's get her all put together. And so here are all of the different characters we can get for our Series 10 purple bags. There are some pretty cool ones in here. I sure hope that we get the full collection. And I believe we got this one right here, which is our Inuit or our native of Alaska. 
and she is beautiful. I absolutely love her mitten snap-on here, so those can pop off if you want. She's got this beautiful fur hat up top and even some fur around her neckline. She also has on these magnificent snowshoes, but I have to tell you, these were super tricky to put on, and you can actually see stress marks already just from putting them on once because they're so tight. But the good thing about them is that they are marked right and left foot. So you just snap them on to the correct foot. And then she has very snuggy looking fur boots as well. She's definitely ready for some fun in the snow. Let's check out our next Series 10 black bag. Cool, maybe another warrior? Let's get him put together. And here's our hunter. I believe he's a hunter anyways. He comes with this rifle accessory. It also has a strap so you can drape it around him to carry it. He's got on this fantastic hat. And of course he has his snap-on beard. If you wanted to take that off, you could. And I love his outfit. Look at that sweater underneath. That is so awesome. And there's our hunter. On to our next purple blind bag. I sure hope we can get the full collection for both of these. I think maybe it's our maid or our waitress. Let's get her put together. And here she is. She's got her fantastic tray with her donut treat on top along with a plate. And look at that donut. It looks like it has chocolate and some sprinkles on top. Madison would love it since she's crazy about chocolate. So her serving tray will pop out of her hand and she has on a beautiful black skirt with an apron here. And I'm not sure if she's supposed to be a maid or a waitress, but she could be either, I guess. And her skirt is a snap off, so that's cool as well. So you can change it out. And she has amazing hair because this is our snap off bun. So we can snap off that hair piece and then she can just have a ponytail around back. I just love that feature. We have the same type hair in our salon set that was an add on for our Playmobil mall. So pretty. All right, it's a black bag next. Oh, cool. I think this might be the sorcerer. Well, let's get him all put together. And here's our sorcerer. Look at this amazing scepter he has. It has this bright red ball at the top and he has magnificent color on his cape and his outfit, and it almost looks like flames. So maybe he's some type of fire wizard. And his hat looks like it has a cobra on it. He is just completely amazing. And you can see his cape is super long. I love him. And moving on, let's do our next purple. Oh cool, I think this is our karate girl. Let's put her together. And it is our karate girl. She looks amazing. I'm so happy that we got her because we have a few requests to make some of our Ricardo characters do karate. So this is gonna be awesome. She has on her blue karate belt and she even has a matching blue bow in her hair. Hiya, ya, ya, hiya. And there's our karate girl. Next up, a black bag. Oh my gosh, I think we got the glow in the dark one. Let's put it together. Here's our glowing ghost pirate. At least that's what I think he kind of looks like. And let me tell you, he is a fantastic glower. Check this out. Oh my goodness, look how much he glows. He is so awesome. And his legs are super duper long. So he has his fantastic sword in his hand. He's got quite a creepy little face up here. I like the stripes on his top. And then he has this cool cape around back as well. Look at his size compared to our regular Playmobil characters. He is super duper tall. He is so awesome. I think he's my absolute favorite character we've ever got because he's so unique with his super tall legs and how well he glows. Okay, next up is another purple blind bag. She almost looks like a dragonfly warrior with her wicked crossbow. So she has this arrow. It's too bad though, the arrow just rests on top. It doesn't actually snap in, which is too bad. I wish that it did so you could look like she was about to take aim. But there's only one that came with the set. And then her crossbow is absolutely amazing. So it snaps up on her arm and she can hold it. And so there it is. Look at her wonderful outfit. I love all of the electric yellow on there and a bit of blue. And it definitely looks like she's got a bit of a insect type body here. And then around back, her wings look more like dragonfly type wings. So I think that's what she is, but I'm not entirely 100% sure. And then some amazing boots on the bottom. Looks like Mrs. Ricardo has a Halloween outfit all picked out. 
And there's our Dragonfly Warrior. Moving on to our next black blind bag. Oh no, we got a duplicate. It's another one of our Egyptian characters. And here is our Egyptian warrior once again. So I'm so disappointed. We checked all of the numbers on the back of our blind bags to try and get all different ones in hopes that we wouldn't have any duplicates and we still managed to get a duplicate. And this one came with an additional or an extra headdress, whereas our other Egyptian warrior did not. So it's a little bit unusual because the two blind bags were not completely identical in what came with them. But he is super cool. And so now he can go hang out with his twin. Let's move on to our next purple blind bag. Well, I think this is our girl maybe going to the sauna or something because I think that she might have a bucket of water as well. Well, let's put her together so we can check her out. And here's our girl character who is carrying this cool bucket of water and this super big scoop. And I believe maybe she's heading off to the sauna and she would use this spoon to pour some more water on the rocks. She comes with rubber flip flops and those will just come on off. And very similar to our Playmobil dollhouse bathroom set, she comes with this towel wrap and it's so amazing. There's an opening on the side and you just slide your character on out of that soft plastic towel. And you can see her beautiful undergarments or bathing suit underneath. And there's our sauna goer. Next up is a black bag. Oh cool, it's another green guy. Let's get him put together. And it looks like we got a leaf warrior or maybe an elf warrior. So he has this magnificent pattern of leaves and stuff all over his body. Kind of looks like leafy type boots. Some great armor up on the arms. And then look at the fantastic pattern on the chest plate as well as the helmet. It is so spectacular. And then of course there is a quiver around back and the bow. And when we take off the helmet you can see our character is a ginger, but it has really long hair around back, so I'm not sure if it's supposed to be a girl elf warrior or if it's a boy with longer hair tied back. What do you think? And that's our elf warrior. Okay, purple bag up next. Cool, I think we got the fishing woman. Well, let's build her and check her out. And here she is, she's spectacular. I just love her bright green boots and her fantastic fishing overalls. And she comes with a basket accessory filled with two crabs and a lobster. She has this great stripy top on with rolled up sleeves and look at her magnificent fishing hat. I love it. She's got her catch for the day. All right, black bag next. Oh my goodness, we got another duplicate. It's another one of our glowing pirates. Well, let's put them together. And here he is. He's just as spectacular as the first one we opened. Let's see if he glows just as well. He is a super duper glower. Check out how much his cape glows. I love it. Purple bag next. Oh neat, I think we got our rice farmer. Let's put her together. And here she is. She is absolutely beautiful. I love her outfit, very traditional Asian top. And look at this fantastic hat. And she has beautiful long black hair in a fantastic braid around back. And there's our rice farmer. Okay, black bag next. Cool, it's a new one, let's put it together. And here is our very mean looking pirate. He has a super cute monkey accessory that is just clinging to his arm. He's very rubbery so he can just slide up on there. He has a great long overcoat on. I like his purple sash because it matches the purple feather on his hat as well. And check him out around back, he's got some really long hair. And if we take off his hat, you can see he even has a bandana. And he wouldn't be a pirate without his sword accessory. And it can also be stored here. And there's our pirate. Purple bag next. Oh, I think we might have got the vampire. Let's get her put together. And here is our vampire. She looks amazing. I just love her outfit. 
Look at her amazing bat necklace. And she also has a bat accessory that can clip onto her hair. I just love that. She has some gray tights and her black shoes on the bottom. And of course, her skirt is a snap off. So you could take that off and change it out if you'd like. And she wouldn't be a vampire without a glass full of blood. And I'm not sure if you can tell with the lights, but her eyes are super creepy because they're red in the center. She's amazing. And there's our vampire girl. Okay, black bag next. We are down to the final eight blind bags. Oh, looks like a new one. Let's put it together and see who we got. And here's our outlaw bandit, I think. He's kind of a Western bad guy. He's got this great big stick of dynamite in his hand. He has on this neat vest, bandana around his neck. He's got a little bit of stubble up here and some really big sideburns. And then he has this great feather in his hat. I love how his vest looks all worn out. And there's our outlaw. Okay, purple bag next. Oh, I am so happy. This is our transparent robot, I think. Let's put her together. And here's our transparent robot. It's kind of hard to see her face on camera here because if we tip her towards the camera, the back side of her hair is making the top part of her face really dark. But her hair is amazing because it is quite rubbery. It's not as hard and rigid as the typical Playmobil hair. So that's kind of neat. So we'll just leave that off so you can see her face while we're talking about her a little bit. But I think it's fantastic how you can see through her and she's got all of these different little gadgets and stuff on the front of her along with this arm plate here and then even her shoes are a little bit transparent and then she has this neat accessory in her hand that looks the same as her face and there's our transparent robot we're down to our final six let's do our black bag next looks like another new one let's build it and check it out and here's our knight warrior he looks amazing he has this exceptional sword and then look at this armor it's pretty fierce looking and his helmet is just as spectacular if we pop it off you can see his front armor plate is coming up to protect part of his face and look at his eyes he looks like he means business and there's our warrior knight up next, one of our purple bags. Oh, very pretty. It looks like maybe a fairy. Let's put her together. And here is our very beautiful fairy. I just love her dress. It is so pretty and it has this really long train around back. And you can see it even has a little bit of glitter on it. And then she has her beautiful blue wings. And those can slide off because they're just on this harness here. And of course, I love her shimmery pinky purple hair. And she also has her star wand accessory. There's our very pretty fairy. Black bag next. Let's hope for no more duplicates. Looks like a new one. Let's put them together. And here is our leaf blower guy. He looks amazing. He's got a bit of stubble up here. He has these fantastic headphones on that would be protecting his ears from the noise created by his leaf blower around back. He has this great big tube up here that would be blowing around all the leaves. And here's his air pack around back. It's got this great rubbery hose attachment as well. This whole pack can pop right off. He has a great checkered shirt underneath. Looks like he's ready to get some work done. Purple one next. So who do we have left to get? Oh, it looks like we have the two different types of queens are the only two we have left to get. Oh no, we got a duplicate. It looks like we got another Inuit. Let's put her together. And here is our duplicate Inuit or native Alaskan character. She's just as beautiful as our first one. And again, very difficult to get the snowshoes on. You can see some of the stress marks just from trying to put her feet in there, but they are on. She's gonna snowshoe on over to her sister. All right, last black one. I hope we get a new one. Oh yay, we did get a new one. Let's put it together. And here's our race car driver. And it looks like he's won his golden wreath. What a lucky guy. So this set actually came with two helmets. So we have a spare and we can take that off to just see his hair underneath. You can see on his uniform, he says number one. I like his pants and his very bright red boots. 
And there is our race car driver. And here's our final blind bag for today. I sure hope we don't get any more duplicates. Oh, I think we got the queen. Let's put her together. And here is our very majestic queen. She is so pretty. She has this wonderful golden scepter with this glittery gem on top. And then she has three gems along here. It's so beautiful. I love all of the flower patterns on her skirt her sash, and then on her back collar. And she wouldn't be a queen without her beautiful crown on top. Her hair is tied back around back. And when we take off her puppy skirt, you can see she still has a pretty purple one underneath. And there's our queen. And here's all 28 of the characters that we opened up today. Little monkey fans, our pirate seems to be missing his monkey. Please leave a comment and let us know if you can spot which Playmobil character our little monkey hopped up to say hello to. Thanks for watching! To join all the fun up in our treetop, please subscribe to Little Monkey Media's channel. Don't forget, if you like our video, please share it and click like. We go bananas for toys!